ain't gonna say no more. <laughs> yeah, man. Three nine hundred song. <laughs> Just talking basketball numbers, man, why you trying to do me? Don't get mad at me, get yeah, at your bitch, she the one that blew me. How you say you tell business when your trunk ain't even rattling? Yeah, I'm scared to run up on you, you dudes be straight tattling. I be on this gangster shit and y'all be on that sucker shit. Hanging with my rapper cane, I'm a bust bottom lip. Catch him at the babysitters, boy, I'm about to lay him down. Smack him for his kick him out, nigga, I'm about to spray him. Man, you already know what it is, man. It's the diesel, man. Fucking with it, man. Back in Lancaster, man. You know how I fuck with it, man. Look, I told y'all when I come back to Lancaster, I'm gonna fuck with Fat Boys, man. The, bur the burrito joint over here, man. Mexican food, man. It's popping over here, man. They got good food. I recommend it. If you're in the Lancaster area, come out here and fuck with it, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna t show you the scenery right quick. So this is right here in front of. Uh, it's right in front of. Um, I believe this is Lancaster Boulevard or Lancaster Avenue, whatever it is. I'm not sure what it is. It's one of these streets over here. It's it's a good little neighborhood out here. It's kind of like downtown, I guess, downtown Lancaster, I guess, I don't know. I don't even know if they got a downtown. They probably do, though. But uh, they got a barber shop right there. They got a few players up in there. I went up there and got my, my, my shit lined up in the back uh, a few weeks ago. The last time I was here, I came over here. It's a Fat Boys Burger joint right here, clean. Come over here and fuck with it, man. But I'm here today to get me a burrito while I talk about the lefty gunplay thing with uh, old boy. Man, we're going to get into that one, man, because it's content. Because it's really content, man. We're going to get into that because it's really content. Anyhow, man, while I wait on my food, check it out, though. So, uh, man, my man Lefty Gunplay was on his shit, right? Yeah, <laughs> fucking with it. Am I applauding the situation, man? I don't know. I can't applaud to that, man, but I'm applauding to my channel. That's how I'm fucking with it, though, man. You already know how it is, man. Anyhow, though, back to, uh, uh, uh. Back to Lefty Gunplay though. So, um, man, he he, he kind of gassed him, right? I really don't even want to comment on it because it's going to sound like I'm trying to inflame the situation. Like I'm spraying hairspray on the on the lighter or some shit. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm like I'm adding gas to the flame, man. Nah, man. It's content, bro. Straight the fuck up. You know what it is. It's content. Everybody talking about it, right? But check this out, though. It might bring some repercussions, man. Man, look, man. Like I said, I fuck with Lefty. I fuck with that whole side, period. And I ain't got nothing against the other side, though. We didn't did all shit. We already went through all that. We're on some more other ass shit right now, right? And I, I, I wouldn't have a problem doing a song with either side. Or, or put the artist that I know or that I fuck with on a song with any one of them, right? Because that seems like it's the way to go. Everybody want to be all on the video, all on the camera. <laughs> Y'all remember Suge, huh? Suge Knight. But anyhow, look, man, check it out. Um, so he said what he said, right? To another artist, right? Now you got two street dudes, two uh, so-called actives, two hitters, as Blue Devil would say. Blue Devil's another dude that he's a content creator and you know, you can't get mad at him for doing content, right? But his thumbnail was a little bit overboard, like he's the one with the problem, to be honest with you, because he put, it was no need to put Lazy, Gun, La Lazy Boy's picture on there X'd out. You know what I'm saying? It was x out. Okay, so we went, we, we, the, the wet burrito just came. Thank you, sir. So it was no need for the man to X him out like that. Right? And then he put hitter lefty. Of course, that's, you, it's bias off top. It's being biased immediately. He has to be on his side regardless. I don't care what the situation may be. He gonna rock with him regardless, right? But the way he put that thumbnail, He's a ball down there. Because if I was on the other side and you did some shit like that, oh man. Look, I'm not here to threaten nobody. I'm not here to beef with nobody. I'm not going to be putting nobody's picture on there exed out. I might, you know, like I said, I've gone, I've got, I've went at it with a couple YouTubers. Look, I don't even want to talk about what happened with old boy from the one I was in my way because he's, look, that's something else. That, that, you know, that shit will get dealt with 
when the time comes, if it's gonna get dealt with, if it ever even makes it there. But anyhow, um, this shit right here, right? You don't know, bro, it's in the air, bro. That's all I'm gonna say. And, and you know, motherfuckers need to run around with security now. You better have some hitters with you. You might get sniped down from a distance. I don't care how many hitters you got. Get sniped down from a distance. All I'm saying is, look, man, you can't just go after a dude just to go after him, man. What was the reason for him? What, what did, I don't even recall, because I, again, I didn't watch the whole Lazy Boy, did he say, I think on one of the shorts, I think, I see Lazy Boy say something, maybe not doing a song with him, I don't know. I don't recall him saying any, any fuck lefty gun player, fuck you, and all, 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 all that. No, I didn't hear, I didn't see none of that, right? So why did lefty go at him like that? You know, he went at him kind of, kind of foul, right? I, and then, you know how social media be, they jump right on it, man. They loving it, right? They want to see a North and South really crack off, right? Come on, man. But it's, whatever happens is going to happen regardless, right? This is just making it exciting for the YouTube world, right? But we're going to see, we're going to see about the street shit now, to be honest with you. Motherfuckers need to be walking around with your, you need to be walking around with your crew, man. That's all I'm going to say. Because that right there might have went a little too far. You remember what happened to old boy when he disrespected the legend? When he respect, disrespected the legends? You think that's going to be, you think, and who was it that did it? Who was it that got went down for that? Was he a celebrity? No. So don't think it's going to be lazy boy going after it. Going after, I don't even think Lazy Boy gonna respond. I would have never said that though. Not to disrespect no other side. Like I said, I didn't beef with them. If anybody would say something about the North Side, would be me and all my partners and all the Upstate South Siders. And the Upstate South Siders are loving this. They loving it. They still beef with them, right? But my point is, Lefty going after him like, okay, it's all good, it's, you know. But now you got to watch yourself. Because now you didn't turn it up a notch. Right? And again, it's not going to be Lazy Boy. It's going to be the one. You think Lazy Boy going to be on here and yip yapping? Nah, he might not respond. The response is going to be someone you least expect. Like I said, he might be in the crowd on your next performance. And he's willing to go down for that. Remember that. You're not going up against dudes. He might not be willing to say... Put it like this, Lazy Boy might not be willing to give up his position as a rapper, right? He's been doing this shit in San Jose for about seven years. He's been on here for a minute now. He done gained notoriety with the people, the streets fuck with him, right? So now, he might already got that street pass where, you know what, Lazy Boy, you ain't gotta do nothing no more, man. You cool, you good, you still solid, you know what I'm saying, whatever. Go on and kick back, we gonna take care of this, man. Cause we need you out here to make money. We don't need you beefing against Lefty Gunplay. Just kick back. So now by you disrespecting Lazy Boy, you didn't disrespect him, you disrespected the whole thing. Around the people around him. Because they took that as a low blow. So, and I'm just talking from a street from a street perspective, man, because I keep it gut, I keep it real, man. You know what I'm saying? I've been out in Texas fucking with just to get away from all that. To get away, because look, I wanna make a song with a southern, I wanna make a song with a northern, right? If I do a song first with a southerner or one of the artists that I fuck with, if he do a song with Swifty or do a song with Lefty or or anybody do a song with, with any uh, with a South Side rapper, the North Siders ain't gonna wanna fuck with it and vice versa. So to eliminate all that, I just I just went to Texas and fuck with it with the Texas rapper, man. Simple as that. You know what I'm saying? But you know, fuck what I'm doing. Let's get back to the, the whole shit about that, right? So now, I don't know, bro. And I, and I, and I, I don't want beef, bro. I don't want beef. I don't want the. I don't want to see sides going at it with each other. Y'all, y'all should have went at it on, on, on verses, man. Put up a couple songs. This would be a good time to go up to go up on some uh, to bet on some numbers. I think that might be lightweight, even regardless. But you know, this is turning into a popularity contest, right? A popularity contest, right? So, you know, in L.A. got all the uh, all the benefits in L.A., man. 
There's even Maz, he said it. There's more opportunities in LA, in Southern California, period. He said that. He said there's more opportunities in Southern California. So, of course, if you want to battle a, a rapper from the North on some, on, on some just views and stuff, you, you're probably going to win. This the way. This the way I do it. Let me get a verse. Let me get one of your verses, and I'll get a verse from somebody else, right? Just the audio, no video, nothing. Just, the, just the audio. Let me take it to New York. Let me take it to Atlanta, and let them, let, let the hood out there hear it, and play the beat to them. She'll be like, "Look, man, I'm gonna play you these two verses, right? You tell me which one, which one is a better verse, without them knowing who it is." I've said this before. Take it to where, where hip hop is, is tough at, where, where, where bars are needed in New York. Take it to the streets of New York and to the streets of Atlanta and to the streets. I can't take it to Houston because Houston's going to be biased. Got to take it to somewhere. Yeah, you got to take it to the East Coast, right? Just get, for example, I'll take Lefty, I'll take Lefty Gunplay, one of his better verses, up against bands, up against bands, better, one of his better verses. No face and ball, just 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 the audio, and take it to the streets. And be like, hey man, y'all check these verses out. Who sounds better? That, that way you know it ain't no biasness. He don't. They don't even know who the rappers are. Trust me, because Rasa Rasa rappers, they don't get no play in the East Coast. Nah, come on now, very like now the Texas rappers is a whole different ball game. They get recognition in the east in, in, in the east coast and in uh, uh and in the south Atlanta Cap G out there G Cap whatever what his name up Face Cap what's his name G Cap G he cool is that his name Cap G G Cap G Cap G Cap no no Cap G my bad Cap G bro I, bro you fuck with it bro I fuck with your music bro you you, you fuck with it and again if you want you a verse man I've been going out to Texas man if you want you a verse go go to Texas and get you a verse man. Get you a verse from Texas, man, because they all got gas, they all got delivery, they all fuck with it, man. You know what I'm saying? You just got to make sure you fuck with a solid one, man. Don't go fucking with no dude that's no good. That's, that's the whole thing, man. You got to be careful, man. So anyhow, back to Lefty and old boy. Lazy boy ain't about to be going back and forth with that. Nah, nah. He about to let that go immediately. He might say something. I don't know. I could be wrong. With this generation? <laughs> ain't no telling, man. But I doubt it. And uh, anyhow, though, so... Like I said, you're not really dis you didn't really disrespect Lazy Boy. You disrespected the whole nation, pretty much. Look, we didn't went at it with the Northerners. We've had, you know, what I'm saying we, the Border Brothers. We we we've been had, like I, I spoke about that in previous videos, man. We didn't did this for years, man, decades, man. You know, what I'm saying we didn't been we didn't been doing this, right? So now we know what it is to go up against these dudes. These dudes just they don't they don't fuck around. They don't let stuff like that go. They don't. You know what I'm saying? They're not gonna let that go. So you if I if they told me if you had uh if you had some advice for lefty for lefty gunplay, diesel, what would you tell them? If somebody was to ask me that question right now, what would I tell Lefty? I said, Lefty, man, with all due respect, man, I fuck with you. I fuck with your music. My partners bump you, some of my, my some of my family members bump your bump your shit, you know what I'm saying? You know, the way you came into the game, whoa, whoa, fresh out of prison, okay, you fucking with it, right? But you need to be on point from here on out, bro, straight up. You need to be on point. There's no there's no falling asleep no more from here on out. The Southern California loves you. And, and you had it to where even, even Northern people, even Northern Rasa would, would, would have followed you up until you said what you said, right? Um, I think you lost a, a lot of fans, but you don't care no more. You don't already got your deal. You're already moving forward. You got you looking at OT now. So so you moving up in the game. This stuff right here might be nothing in a couple months or never know. Next year this might be nothing. You might be on another level, right? He might be on another level. I don't know. But remember, there's going to be other people that's going to be at the same level at the bottom that don't care. That don't care. That's that's. That's willing to be the one in prison to say, I'm the one that knocked down Lefty Gunplay. And this, all this stuff might, might, it might get, you know, it might get turned into another level. I don't know. Let me get off that subject though, because it's, like I said, man, just, just be on point, man. You got to be on point, man, for the rest of your life, to be honest. With you. And I'm not, I'm not, 
I'm not picking at you. I'm just saying I'm just keeping it real from a gangster standpoint, man. From a street standpoint. Look, even me, I'm not famous. I'm not a famous rapper. I'm not a famous gangbanger. Matter of fact, I am. Yeah. I am famous in the Bay. I am famous in the town, man, to be honest with you. So, but I don't got to be like this no more, right? I don't got to be like that looking over my shoulder. I do got to look over my shoulder for the police, but I ain't got to be looking over my shoulder over the rival no more, right? I see Northerners on 38, man. What's heading, man? It's good. I see Sunaeus in LA, man. What's heading? It was good, right? In prison, like I said, like I keep repeating myself, in prison, I know where I got to be. I know where I, where I know where I stand. I know who I fuck with. I just got off the phone with one of my close friends, man, from La Mirada. You know what I'm saying? Trying to get his permission to do a video about him, right? You know what I'm saying? But uh, we're going to get into that later on. Anyhow, uh, with that being said, man, it's a it's an iffy situation, man. Like I said, that's my next channel. Stay tuned. That's coming up next. Iffy situation, man. IF, man. Because everything around this motherfucker, everything is an iffy situation, man. You know what I'm saying? Even being with a broad is iffy nowadays, man, because you don't know what the fuck she got going on. She she probably being sneaky on your ass, man. Look, I'm going left field with the conversation, man. Let me get up out of here. Let me eat this burrito, this wet burrito. I ain't going to show y'all. I'm just going to eat it. But I, I don't do I don't food content, man. That's for some other people do that, man. I don't want to sit here and watch. I don't want to watch. I don't want viewers to watch me eat. Eat my, maybe eat on the streets, but not eat a meal, literally. Literally eat a meal? Man, no, y'all, just come on, man. What I look like having y'all watch me eat my meal? Come on, man. I'm gone, man. 3900 on with John Diesel, boy. In Lancaster. Talking about the, the famous game banger. Oh, boy, uh, Lazy Boy. Yeah, yeah, man. Let's get, let's see what happens, man. I hope nothing happens, bro. I don't want, man, come on, man. Let's get your money doing content, man. Get your money doing music, man. John Diesel, man, I'm out of here, man. Gone.